Hi all, uh, welcome to my channel. Today's topic is about uh, how we can onboard Azure policy uh, via Terraform scripts. And uh, for this example, I have picked uh, QWall services. Uh, to implement uh, Azure policy via Terraform, uh, we need to follow a few steps. Number one, we need to create a policy definition file and uh, either uh, we can use a built-in templates or we can create a custom definition and here we are going to see an example with custom uh, mode of creation second uh, we need to create a azure policy set definition uh, uh, this is to group the policy definition file into one initiative and uh, it can be grouped uh, uh, based on the project uh, uh, policy category and the third step is uh, we need to create a, a policy assignment either we can uh, um, link that policy set definition to a subscription or management group or a resource group or resource directly here in this demo uh, we are going to look on uh, how we i have created a, a policy definition and policy set and a subscription policy assignment and uh, let me expand uh, azure policy definition what i have created now so i have picked azure diagnostic setting and azure key vault should have firewall enabled uh, uh, configuration that two uh, two set of features i have taken so in that first definition um, i have uh, uh, configured in a custom mode and um, so this is a uh, audit diagnostic log um, in the left hand side and uh, uh, my terraform script on the right hand side so uh, to to complete the configuration i need to have a policy rule which is a mandatory uh, because this is a custom policy so i need to add the policy rule and uh, so this uh, audit diagnostic uh, audit.json file i think you can take it from uh, your azure portal or uh, for, uh, you can take it from uh, microsoft uh, documentation as well so you need to copy the correct syntax else you will not be able to run the a file uh, it will it end up in uh, error messages while you're running the uh, code and second is a parameter so you need to copy the right parameter configurations so i have copied uh, uh, from the json file i have copied the parameter from effect uh, to the appropriate uh, um, syntax yeah i have copied it so next is metadata so i have taken a category as a key vault which is there in the uh, json file you can inherit the same and you can put it there and um, this, so this is how i have created this uh, uh, first uh, policy definition file and similarly the second uh, as similar to first uh, i have uh, taken a, um, um, azure uh, metadata uh, and then i have taken a policy rules and i copied the whole uh, json file and i, I pasted in the uh, terraform file and also similarly like uh, uh, my parameter files as well i have copied and pasted in the uh, definition file so each has it these are all the mandatory elements which i need to populate uh, to create the policy definition file so once you have uh, done the uh, policy de definition file just try to put a terraform plan to see like you are getting any error messages or not so then then the next step uh, what we have to do is we need to create a policy set definition file uh, so that i can group both uh, key one and key two policy definition into one specific uh, policy set definition so this is a policy set definition uh, is an initiative where we can group the whole uh, policy uh, definition what we have created on top so i have referred both the uh, key vault uh, um, uh, policy definition id uh, in that uh, uh, policy set definition file and uh, with that i have uh, copied the values uh, we need to keep the exact value in the policy definition reference else you will be end up in uh, getting an error as an um, uh, json formatting error and then uh, finally like we need to go for azure uh, subscription policy assignment so here the example what i picked is azure subscription policy assignment so i have given my subscription id and policy definition id so policy definition id is nothing but uh, my policy set definition uh, 
uh, ID. I started uh, executing the whole Terraform uh, for policy what I have created. And you can see like uh, multiple uh, IDs has been populated here. It's uh, nothing but uh, policy set definition ID, policy assignment ID and uh, policy definition IDs. Uh, so you can navigate to Azure portal and you can validate these policy IDs. It will be available there. If you move on to Azure portal and uh, navigate to the policy section in a subscription blade, uh, you can see like the policy definition uh, policy uh, uh, initiative has been assigned at the subscription level so this is a policy definition assignment and uh, if you can uh, look on the name at the bottom like resource logs in the keyword yeah that's uh, uh, azure subscription policy assignment name that will be visible here so if you click on it you can see like two policy names uh, will be visible under uh, uh, under this uh, assignment either like uh, example uh, azure key vault should have the firewall and the resource log in key vault should enable so this those two definitions which i have created uh, and uh, with the policy set i have uh, uh, matched those, those two policies uh, key vault one and key vault two uh, configurations yeah validate it with that uh, you can see exactly what what we have implemented now uh, if you navigate to the definitions and if you uh, can um, do a uh, lookup via definition filter by a definition you can see like the custom policies are getting visible and if you see at the top there is a policy initiatives two policies has been assigned these are the two policies which are assigned to that uh, initiative so these are the two things mm, yeah i hope you guys like this video and uh, i will uh, I'll post few more videos in upcoming days on this Azure policy. As of now, I have created a single Terraform file to give a demo about uh, how we can implement this Terraform uh, script uh, for Azure policies. Uh, so in upcoming videos, I will add a few more uh, advanced configurations, see like how we can uh, introduce looping and how we can add uh, more and more policies into a single definition set actually. Thank you.